Latoya, tell us a story that makes you smile about how you and the Victor app has helped a small business or small business owner. Absolutely. So um, throughout this journey, one of the things that has kept me motivated to pursue the execution of this app and its launch um, is my conversations with the underrepresented business owners. Uh, one in particular, uh, here in central Indiana, we have a woman, her name is Nicole Kearney, and she owns a company called Sip and Share Wines. She specializes in vegan artisanal wine, and it is delicious. And so what we've been able to help her with is getting, you know, amplifying her presence, getting her in front of a broader base of consumers. Uh, Indianapolis is a very diverse and welcoming city, and we have what I call a lot of allies. Um, and with these allies, these are people who would normally know of Nicole and the Sip and Share Wine experience um, just because um, lack of cross-cultural communication, right? So what Victor has been able to help Nicole do is get in front of a variety of communities and wine connoisseurs. Everyone loves wine, regardless of your background. And so she acknowledged the fact that Victor uh, is an app that helps locate those underrepresented businesses, um, especially in the Midwest. And that's what we aim to do. You just think about locations that are not known for their diversity, but when you dig into them, they are very diverse. And so it's a matter of getting those businesses in front of those people so that they can support. And we were ecstatic to be a part of that journey with Nicole and, you know, really helping broaden her base. And we were just one piece of her marketing plan, but that's the resource we want to provide to our business owners. You're going to have this grander, larger marketing plan. Now, how do you execute and what are the tactics? And Victor is going to be that B2C tool for our business owners to get in front of consumers. What a wonderful story. Latoya, it was epic having you on. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me, Rick. I really appreciate it.